What's up, everybody? Jason here from jazbeescasebreaks.com. We just sold out Jaspie's 9-box Millville Meteor Baseball Mixer Random Teams, where we're also giving away a Mike Trout from Triple Threads, which is out of three, and it is a BGS 9-5-10. So the way this works, guys, is first, there's 30 spots sold. Everybody gets a random team in the MLB. Just remember, no veteran commons slash paper will ship from this mixer. We'll do the break, open up all nine boxes. Then at the end of the break, we'll take all 30 customer names and randomize them again in a separate dice roller randomizer. And customer at number one, top name, gets the Mike Trout Relic, which is out of three from Triple Threads, graded at 9, 5, 10. Just to show you guys, beautiful looking card. One out of three. Very nice. Maybe even have some good sub subgrades. Centering was a 10, edges 9, 5. Corners were a 9, which is kind of understandable in a thicker card like this. And surface was 9.5. Pretty strong. So there you go. We'll give away that at the end of the break. So if you bought a spot, you automatically get an entry. And if you want a spot, you automatically get an entry as well. So customers bought in straight up from Matt down to Joseph. And then Joseph from Contenders 1 down to Aaron Petter from Contenders 2. So there you go. And there's the team. So let's do the break first, guys. Let's roll it. And we got ourselves a five and a two for seven times. So good luck seven times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Franklin, down to Matt Arnold. All right, five and a two, seven times. Seven times here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Mets down to the Blue Jays. All right, so frankly, you got the Mets. Kevin with the Angels. Matt with the A's. Aaron with the Yankees. Matt L. with the uh, Padres. Jerry with the uh, Royals. Christopher with the Nationals. Josh with the Dodgers. Matt L. with the Astros. Kevin with the Cardinals. Oliver Smith with the Reds. Grant with the Marlins. Aaron with the Rays. Matt Arnold with the Seattle Mariners. Joseph with the Phillies. Last ball mojo. As well as the Rangers. Uh, Anthony with the Braves. Matt L. with the Brewers. Shane with the D-backs. D-Mac with the Cubs. Ray with the Orioles. Cohen with the Red Sox. Alan with the Giants, Travis with the Indians, Joshua with the Pirates, Michael with the Twins, Johnny, you have the White Sox, Derek with the Tigers, Kevin with the Rockies, and Matt with the Toronto Blue Jays. So if anybody wants to trade, give you guys a quick minute. So there you guys go. Kane gets a spot in the Immaculate uh, Grizzlies R&B. I got some trade offers for the Angels and Mets. Let me know. So it looks like Kevin probably doesn't want to trade the Angels for the Mets, right? But he's willing to trade the Rockies. And then Joseph's saying Phillies for Mets. So let me know which one you guys want to accept.
Okay, so you want to do the angels for Matt, uh, Matt's the... Uh... Okay, cool. Let's just close it then. So Kevin, angels for the Mats. You guys both are from contenders too. Sweet, a little plus sign there for you guys. All right, so there you go. There's the trades, and let's just stick with that. Trade one to close TWC. All right, sweet, guys. Should be a fun mixer, guys. There you go. We had one trade, guys. Frank then has the Angels. Kevin now has the Mets. And there you go. And start with uh, some of the more heavier base stuff. We'll work our way to like Definitive and Dynasty. So you were in LA and then moved to New Jersey. So Mets fan for about years now. Nice. What's so funny about the Angels for Mets, Jeff? <laughs> Customers got what they wanted. Got their PC teams. Or at least fans of their team. Oh, gotcha, Jeff. No, I feel you. I feel you. Yeah, that's the one thing. You never know with Trout. Just because he could be like in Dynasty, he could be in Definitive. You know, some of the higher end stuff, I guess, right? Yoan Moncada. Trey Turner. Matt Holiday. Verlander Hyper. Yeah, yeah, no, I got you. Yeah, yeah. It probably has to take your favorite team to give up the Angels, right? Pretty much. There are Cotton, Gino Suarez, Freddie Freeman, Kyle Schwarber, Brandon Belt. I'm not penny sleep all these X Factor ones. Stanton, Yelich. Oh, this is a rare Yelich Miami version. And it wasn't even that long ago. Nice, Frank. That's awesome, man. Yeah, well, I mean, I, I grew up here in L.A. too. And, uh, I mean, most of my family were, were grew up in, uh, in East L.A. And, you know, Dodger fans, so. 
kind of just went with that crowd. But like for football, for me, I just I didn't really have a team, and I didn't want to follow my my family from the crowd being like a big Raiders nation. So I was just like, I want to find something different. And being in LA, there was no team when I was growing up in the '90s, so I was like able to venture out. A lot of my cousins liked their Raiders because they were in LA when they were growing up. So uh, for like hockey and, and and baseball, Dodgers and Kings for sure is what is what I root for. one some optics hobby well trust me Kevin my Eagles are not doing the best either <laughs> but shockingly they still have a chance I don't think so, Jeff. I, I mean, Wentz hasn't played well. I mean, I don't know. I might be one of the few Philly fans that don't believe it, but I don't think so. I, he hasn't played well, but, I mean, it's not all on him either. The offensive line is just trash. Even getting healthy has been trash for them. You know, so. I don't think so. I think it's going to take Wentz, like, to have, like, crazy, crazy, like, game or injured for Hurts to really come in. But I don't, I don't, I don't think so, man. I don't know. Wentz is, it's a love hate thing with him, you know. It's like, uh, some, it's all about his accuracy, man, and, and just holding on to the ball too long. You know, I'm sure, I'm sure, like ten of those sacks that he's taken this year have been because of him, because he held on to the ball too long. But dude has like forty sacks. Other than that, like the other thirty times, his line has just literally not given him more than like three seconds to like, to throw the ball. So. Like I said, it's not really all on him, but it's just he's the one that's always going to take the blame, you know? And that's the one thing, man. Yeah, it's just there's I, it's today. I'm like, oh, man, why'd you do that? And then I'm like, wow, what a great pass. <laughs> I'm like, that's how I am pretty much every weekend. I haven't had to haven't had the chance to say, wow, this has been a great game by him. I think for me, it's like him not turning over the ball is the best game for him. But that's that's how I am all the time. Yeah, I, I think they need a full revamp of the whole line, besides, like, Kelsey. I'm okay with Sam Malo, and I'm okay with, like, Mylotta. He actually hasn't played bad, but it's just, it's just, I don't know. Randy Rosarena, hollow Raider rookie. Not bad. Clovis Jet. But, yeah, it's just, it's not all just the one person, it's everybody. People be dropping balls as well. But shockingly, I, I, I think, honestly though, I think if the Eagles division wasn't so terrible, I think maybe they would give, like, Hurts a chance. But the fact is that they're still terrible and they still have a chance to win the division and go to the playoffs. Uh, that's probably the reason why, too, they're sticking with Wentz. Ronald Acuna Jr. I'd probably have to say the Eagles, honestly. The, the Giants haven't played bad, Jeff. I mean, it's, is it weird for me to say that? Like, they... Daniel Jones, man, that dude can fly. Wow, look at this. Luis Robert Black, and don't tell me this is a one on one, right? No, it's out of 25. Damn, that would have been crazy. This looks beautiful with the Chicago White Sox. 20 out of 25. Wow, what a box. Johnny with the Chicago White Sox. That is a beauty. And mythical, hollow as well, Luis Robert. Lux. Rona Bolaños, hollow. Marcus Seaman. To 199.
Nico. Cody Bellinger. I know Aguilar's. I never thought Aguilar was bad. I just think that he had a horrible down year last year. That's all. People kind of forget that the uh, two years ago, you know, in the Super Bowl. I mean, the Super Bowl year, he had his best career year. He had like nine touchdowns, and then he had like over eight or nine catches for like over a hundred yards in the Super Bowl. But last year was just such a down year. The last year or so. So, good for him to get a fresh start over there. But, yes, earlier, kind of a tough catch, but definitely catchable for him earlier. Could have caught that. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Jeff, I think you, you kind of jinxed this. A one-of-one one Mike Trout mythical gold vinyl. Jeez. What a box. Have you guys seen this? Oh, God. That is, that is crazy. Paul Goldschmidt at 125. Yeah, and it was traded. Well, it was just a mythical. Oh, that's sweet, though. Yeah. The gold vinyl? Yeah. That's legit. That's crazy. Trade Mojo? Yeah. Well, they traded for their PC teams. Oh. But it, one of them was another one. <laughs> yeah. I Now I just want the Mets to have a one-on-one -on -one so we can just make it even. That is... That is pretty insane, guys. I mean, not often does this happen, though. You know, the, 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 we don't just—they don't just hand out one of ones, especially Trout's. And the fact is that with Trout, the only thing you can really get is inserts and numbered cards, right? From Panini, that's the only thing you can really get. There's nothing else. You can't get his autograph, so probably sells pretty well, like Matt Matthew's saying, because this is all you can really get, right? That is awesome, man. Congrats. But it's still early though, right? I mean, hey, there's still potentially some chance at other boxes for the Mets and everybody, so. Let's keep it going, guys. 2020 Bowman. So again, this one has prospects. And uh, let's see what kind of prospects we can get out of here. Dude, I'm in love with this uh, this Luis Robert card. The the black optic out of 25 just looks so perfect with the White Sox colors. Oh, fumble! Wow. Did it really? Wow. That's pretty good for a uh, non license, how people would say. I don't know. I don't really get the whole. I don't really care for the whole licensing part of it. So, if a gold vinyl out of 101 sold for 3000 can we say about maybe close to 1000 for out of 25 Because out of 25 it'd probably go to what? To 10 right? Maybe there's some other inserts that make it between 25 to 10. Then you have the green out of 5 and then 101. But I'd probably expect that to go for like 500 maybe. Which is still a great come up for like a non-auto.
Yeah, they got they got lucky there, man. Dustin May, two fifty. Tyler Freeman, Adley. The paper's not going to ship, but I'll throw in the bigger rookies, though. I'm like Jason Dominguez and whatnot. Dwayne Dunny. Who's Robert Insert? Oh, that's a penalty. Wow, that wasn't a penalty? It looked like it was really close. He, like, got him right before he, he was trying to catch that ball. Oh, they did call it. Manuel Vargas. Robert Pawson. Arsenal is Aquino. Bobby Witt. Brandon Howlett to 250. Red Sox going to Cohen. Shimmer, Ryan Mountcastle. Dominguez paper. Yankees going to Aaron. Luis Robert paper.
Uh, not sure, Jason. I mean, I'm still here for the next couple hours. But we would probably have to start getting it closer so people could jump in. Uh, but I don't like to rule out any break. Unless, like, I'm only here for, like, less than an hour and it's still, like, in the 20s. But, um, hopefully, man. Just grab your spots, guys. That's the best thing. People see that the break's moving. They're going to jump in as well with you. Yeah, like, the worst thing is, of course, it just doesn't end breaks tomorrow, but... I'm still here for a couple more hours, man. Probably looking at gold standard, right? Football. Yeah, guys, I mean, after this, Immaculate Baseball is within reach. Don't worry about the big, expensive teams like the White Sox and them. If they don't get random number block and those are the last two, three teams, someone will pull the trigger on one of them. And then we can get that break done. Um... Immaculate Basketball, one boxer, is down to like seven left in a little random number block that has the Grizzlies, Wizards, and Cleveland Cavaliers for like $65, $68. I think we can still get them throw in that break as well. I mean, there's there's still plenty of time, guys. And if we're busy and we're selling out breaks, guys, I'll stay a little late, later. Shogo. Let's do it, guys. Charlie Blackman, Matt Dice, Lewis Thorpe, Minnesota. Good, man. Thankful. Grateful. Can't complain, man. Domingo Leva. Arizona go to Shane. How about you, man? How's the PS5? <laughs> Abraham Toro. And last one here. Loving it or what? <laughs> and Victor Vodnik. So this would be a prospect ticket. But it actually says ATL, so I already have that one there. So Atlanta with that one. Wow, Jason wouldn't caught it. Alright, next box, guys. We'll go to Chronicles. Not even once, too, man. Everybody's struggling. Eagles just, their line gets healthy and they still whack. 
Although the, the bright spot for the defense is that they're playing well, but man, that O-line is just so bad. Got Lux here score Francisco Lindor twenty ninety nine. Brandon McKay, Bo Bichette, and Chris Paddock to twenty five. Nice one right there. Padres with that one. Ooh, this is a nice little trout right here. A little prism silver. Boba Shag, Gavin Lux, Luis Roberts. Out of 25, Clevenger. Yeah, man, I'll, we'll have to see who's out with the Eagles soon. We can either get a quarterback coach back again. I'm really missing Frank Wright, although he's doing wonderful things over there with Indianapolis. Trout here. Jordan. Randy Dobnik. Oh, shot rookie. Michael Baez, Gavin Lux, Silver, Marcelo Aquino, Bobichet rookie, Hoscar, for Atlanta, Jordan, Luis Robert, Mike Trout, Gavin Lux. Juan Soto, Relic. Marcelo Aquino, Louis Thorpe Silver, and a Matt Chapman. Cracked Ice to Alright, next one, we're going to do the rip box, guys. So just a little FYI. We're not going to rip the cards for you. You guys can rip them yourself. So, of course, the card on top is where it's going to go to. Did you really, man? That's sweet, man. There you go. One PS4, uh, one PS5 free. Yeah, I've, I've seen a lot of people razzing a lot of them in uh, Facebook groups. For like over a thousand. And people were filling those up, too. I was like, damn. So all of these cards are rip cards, guys. There was a Topps exclusive online. So this Brooks Robinson, of course, is going to go to the Baltimore Orioles. And, of course, you know, if you decide to rip it, you can. And you can be exclusive mini base, exclusive image variation base, or an exclusive autograph mini. Tear if you dare. Uh, yes, Cameron. So for the one boxer, if we sell that filler out, that unlocks the break. This will go, of course, to the... Um, Baltimore Orioles. All 
Next one we got. Was that a 99? Roberto Alomar. That is a... Uh, Blue Jays edition. Yeah, so these ones are numbered. They're numbered to 99. This one was 99, and Brooks Robinson was to 99. We have to 50. This one's Paul Molitor, 34 out of 50. And this one is number to 25, and it's Ken Griffey Jr., 2 out of 25. Mariners edition, going to Matt Arnold. That is sweet. Imagine getting in a exclusive photograph of him, mini. There you go, very nice. All right, three boxes left, guys. So we have the Topps Chrome, Dynasty, and Definitive left. All the big boxes here. out of five. All right, good luck, guys. Wow, do we have two reds? Wow. This is a red autograph as well. It's for the Detroit Tigers. Jake Rogers red Which actually I think it's out of 10. No, it's five out of five. Yeah, that's right Detroit Tiger is going to Derek red autograph rookie very nice And the red base Is Brent Suter that is red as well. Five out of five for the Milwaukee Brewers. Going to Matt Al. Oh, wow. Way to go, Derek Carr. It's over.
<laughs> That's amazing. We only lost one game. It was against the Raiders in the whole calendar year. <laughs> that is ridiculous. Alrighty, guys. Two boxes left. Good luck. Let's go Dynasty first, and then we'll go end off with Definitive. Alright, good luck. I don't know, man. I, I, I would probably say Kansas City. I know Pittsburgh's undefeated, but there's been a few games that Pittsburgh could have lost, like, big time. Not that, not that Kansas City hasn't done anything like that, but I think I would only take Piz, uh, Kansas City just because they've been there, and most of the team that was there last year is there this year. Looks like Diamondbacks, no? Maybe Reds? But we'll find out, guys. One of them has to go to the Super Bowl, right? They can't play against each other. Joey Votto. 5 out of 10. There you go, Cincinnati Reds. Oliver Smith, there you go, man. But yeah, the good thing is that, you know, they they would have to play each other if that was the case, so. One of them's gonna make it. Alright, and the last boss guy's definitive. see a gold frame bills <laughs> our right, first one Dustin Pedroia nice patch right here look at that four out of ten Boston Red Sox going to Cohen A scratch on this uh, top loader, so I don't think that your card is scratched. Kyle Tucker, 11 out of 50 for the Houston Astros. Matt L. And a nice Yadier Molina, 19 out of 30. Well, that's a very hot take. <laughs> that's a very hot take. But hey, that's true. End of a career. We'll see how long both of them last. So, we'll find out. We got a dual autograph that features Andre Dawson and Vladimir Guerrero Sr. Twelve out of thirty-five. So that is going to be going to the Expos, which is a Washington Nationals and Christopher. We have Paul Goldschmidt, forty-three out of fifty. We have a Jorge Posada for the Yankees. Pinstripe and autograph 5 out of 10. Yankees going to Aaron. We have just a patch, but a little bit of stars in there, too. Maybe for 4th of July or something. Zach Granke, 33 out of 35, and that is Arizona Diamondbacks. And the 
last one here is 8 out of 20, Ryan Zimmerman, Washington Nationals. All right, and there you go, guys. That was the break. So, again, this mixer didn't go well for you guys. You still have a chance right here, guys. Here's a Mike Trout. It's a one out of three. Nine, five, ten out of triple threads from 2015. Tops triple threads. So... Here you go, guys. Good luck. Everybody has a shot at it. And actually, let me do a quick recap, too. So you guys seen all these definitives we just did. Uh, but we had some really nice stuff pop out of here for a nice little nine-box mixer. Joey Votto. We got two reds out of the um, Sapphire. Ken Griffey Jr., Rip, Molitor, Alomar, Robinson. Got some autos here from the Chronicles. We got some autos right here in colored cards from there. But this is probably one of my favorite ones, guys. This Luis Robert, Raider Rookie, is, like, beautiful. I don't know. Just I just love that it matches, color matches the team. And then we had a one-on-one -on -one gold vinyl mythical of Mike Trout. So they go, regardless, if Franklin doesn't win this Mike Trout, even though he has the Angels, he's going to get this, though. <laughs> so there you go. So good luck. Let's switch scenes. Here's the dice roller. Here's the customer names. All right, got all 30 there. Let's roll it. And it is a full 12. Ah, people, I get uh, probably people like that, right? Full 12. 12 times. So good luck. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12. 12 times. Jared K from Contenders number one after 12 times. Wow. Congratulations, man. And I don't think I called your name, Jarrett. Which you had the Kansas City Royals. So there you go, man. Congratulations. You just won this trout. I'm going to tag it for you. And uh, we'll get that out to you, buddy. So appreciate it, guys. This was the Jaspies 9 Box Millville Meteor uh, Baseball Mixer on jaspiescasebreaks.com.